welcome to Lopez Explorer. From this point, you're going to encounter an intersection when you're in about 10 minutes into the hike. You're going to be going to the left. The one on the right will bring you back if you do the loop. To the caves is about 1.5 miles from here, 3 miles total, with an elevation of, of about 850 to 900 feet. This trail is not easy. It's going uphill all the time and the terrain is very difficult. I did it on a rainy day, so that made it even more difficult. It's muddy and slippery, so please be very careful and always bring plenty of water, especially on the hot days. This is on Simi Valley, California. The first half a mile or so, you're gonna be hearing the noise from the 118 freeway. This is a very beautiful hike. It has so many cool rock formations and caves that you can explore. If you use all trails application in around 0.9 miles, you kind of keep going up, uphill instead of going to the left. And then you're gonna end up on a huge rock with these holes. Once you make it to this point, you are actually standing on top of the cave. You just look for it underneath on the right or the left. Be very careful because it's very, very slippery, especially when wet. It actually took me about 10 minutes to find the caves, so be patient. It's not easy to find them, but once you get in it, it's actually very rewarding. This part usually has ropes, but for some reason I didn't have them, so I have to go on the other side to get in. This is the other side where you can enter. Just be extra, extra careful because it's very dangerous and there's a big drop. So please be safe. I went on December of 2022. It was a cold rainy day but the reward was having the whole place to myself.
it was time for a snack and take a break. This bench was kind of hard, but good that I brought my own hammock. I got so lucky. You see the rainbows? Click on the icons on the screen to watch more of my adventures. Thank you so much for your time and watching. Until next time.